Hello everyone! In today's video, I'll show you how to create a Facebook page, setup, and optimization. Let's get started! Have you thought about creating a Facebook account? Maybe you haven't decided to join this social network yet, but you're curious. Or maybe you're looking to create a Facebook business page. Or perhaps you already use it regularly. But you want to know how you can further customize your account and better configure your privacy settings. Facebook, which is owned by Meta, is a network that offers a lot of options to its users. First, I will be showing you how to create and set up your Facebook account. And then later on, I will give you four steps to walk you through the Facebook page optimization process. Here we go. How to create a new Facebook account. Creating a Facebook account is the first step to start advertising on Facebook and promoting your brand. To create your Facebook account, go to www.facebook.com. Then click Create an Account. Enter your name, email or a cell phone number, password, date of birth, and gender. If the system indicates that your password is not secure enough, try adding more characters or combining upper and lower case letters. Remember, you must be at least 14 years old to do this. Finally, you'll need to confirm the email address or cell phone number you entered earlier. To confirm the email, click or tap on the link in the confirmation email you received. To confirm the cell phone number, you must enter the code you received by SMS in the confirm box, which will appear when you log in. Moving on, how to get more out of your Facebook account. If you have followed the steps I've showed you earlier, you have already managed to create your own Facebook account. Welcome! Let's see how to use this social network and take advantage of the different options it offers. Personalize your Facebook account. Your Facebook account is like an online letter of introduction, which serves as a way for other users to find you. That's why, after creating your account, the next thing you need to do is to personalize it. To begin with, change your profile and cover photos, since they are the most visible elements. Find content published by other people. The cruise of social network is to see what other people publish and to share your own content. To do this, you have different options. Adding friends is a fundamental step. Unlike other networks where you follow strangers, on Facebook, it is typical to add only people you know to your contacts. Finally, you can also view public content through fan pages. You can see the publications on a page by entering it directly or by clicking on like or follow to have them appear in your news section. Publish your own content. Are you ready to share your thoughts with the world? Share them in your feed, page, or other public pages or groups. You have different options such as text, photos or videos, surveys, ad files, and others. Edit your privacy options. Privacy is one of the issues that most concerns Facebook users, so it's critical to set it up right from the start. To view and change your privacy options on Facebook, click the arrow in the upper right corner. And from there, click Settings. Then, select Privacy from the left sidebar menu. Once there, spend some time exploring your options and choosing the ones that suit you best. Moving on, here's how to create a Facebook business page. Facebook pages are used to promote companies and brands, but you can also use them to get in touch with other fans of an artist, promote your website or blog, or create a community around a topic that interests you. To create your own Facebook business page, follow these steps. Go to the page creation page. Facebook.com slash pages slash create slash. Choose the name of your page. Choose the type of page you want to create. Choose the profile and cover image. Customize the tabs that are displayed on the page. 
and a call to action button, for example, so that users can contact you or download your application. With this, you can learn how to create a business page after you create a Facebook account yourself. So there, you have easily created a Facebook account and a Facebook business page. Now let's move on to four ways to optimize your Facebook page. Number one, select the best template. Facebook offers pre-made page templates to help you optimize your page for the types of business you are running, including services, shopping, business, venues, nonprofits, politicians, restaurants, and cafes. The template simply dictates the layout of buttons and tabs that have been found most efficient for specific business types. You can edit and customize them as much as you like after you pick one. Number two, upload your hot, seasonal, and other products. Speaking of tabs, you can set up a shopping section and add your products one by one by specifying their names and prices and uploading their photos. The huge advantage of doing that, apart from giving your Facebook audience a separate shopping section when they can access seasonal offers and hot deals, is that you will be able to tag your products in your page photos and videos. This way, if your video goes viral on Facebook, people will be able to click through the product listing right from within the video. Number 3. Enable Reviews Nearly all potential customers consult online ratings and reviews before making a purchase. I am one of those customers, and I've noticed that Facebook reviews tend to be more positive than those on other platforms. This may be due to the fact that Facebook is a very personal platform. People don't go there first to vent their frustration at companies. On the contrary, they are there to talk to family and friends. That being said, Facebook is perfect for publicizing your customers' reviews. To do that, go to Settings, and click Edit, Next Review, to allow visitors to review your page. If things go wrong, and that may happen to the best of us, you'll be able to switch those reviews back off going forward. Lastly, we have number 4. Update and engage. No optimization tactic can save your Facebook page unless you update it often and engage with your audience. There are a few audience building hacks you can try. Ask questions to engage your followers in discussions. Post curated content. Upload short and well annotated videos. Stream live videos from virtual events. Tag other business pages and upload images. You can use visual to further market your business without being too salesy or intrusive. So there you have it. I hope you find this video helpful. And before this video ends, did you know that you can turn every prospect into a client using a hyper-personalization on Facebook, LinkedIn, emails, and landing pages? Get 3 times more replies, 325% more conversions, and more sales from every message you send by using Salipix by Technic Force, a multi-platform hyper-personalization. Bring home new clients every day. Salipix is the most powerful personalization suite. It supports multiple campaigns. You can customize unlimited landing pages, create unlimited image variations, send unlimited emails, and has ever-growing public template library and free credits every month. So try Sell It Pigs now. Just go to gosellitpigs.in. And that is it for today's video. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one.